excited to introduce you to my first guest. She's an internationally acclaimed actress who has won numerous awards for her many, many memorable roles, including an Emmy Award for her role as Elizabeth I and an Academy Award for her remarkable portrayal of Elizabeth II in The Queen. Now she looks back at her distinguished career in her intimate new memoir, In the Frame, a heavy book for its size, full of words and full of fabulous pictures. Please welcome the incredible Dame Helen Mirren. Beautiful being here with oh, you. I might cry. Say, yes, I might cry. <laughs> I might cry having you as a guest. <laughs> no, really, it's uh, it's just an incredible, incredible thing to meet you finally. Yes, finally. And, uh, I know. I feel we have some strange connection, not just to do with the hair. Luckily, I had my hair curled today. Uh -huh. Otherwise, it would have come out looking almost exactly like uh, you. Well, you look gorgeous. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, isn't she amazing? <laughs> well, there's so many questions. I love the book, by the way. Um, and yeah, it, like it, she's had time to read it. Uh, it's you know, yeah. it's I've looked at every single picture <laughs> and all the all you have postcards, you have early pictures. Yes. Um, what inspired you to write a book now? I mean, you're you're far from the end of a career. Absolutely. Um, and I, and, and uh, you know, hopefully after this book, I'm I, now I've started. I'm, I might go on and write some more. I would love to. I mean, partly Martha because someone else wrote a book about me, and I was so sort of cheesed off about uh. that. Right. But um, I thought, and he was off. What a nice way to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Do you not say cheesed off in no, America? No, we say pissed off. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, we say that too, incidentally. Uh -huh. But, um, uh, you know, and so it, it's making the truth. Money you want to so you you write the truth, the, well, the, the, how you see your life, not how yes, somebody else sees exactly. your life. Yes, exactly. Share my life in my way. Right. You know, it's never the whole truth, is it? But. Um, but, you know, it, it's a part of the truth of my life. And I wanted it to be benign and loving and about love, which is really what it is, and being loved and, and um, the fun that I've had in my life. Well, and the, and the incredible, incredible career of, of role, the, just the roles you have played. First of all, I'd like to start backwards because um, the, the last uh, thing I saw was the Elizabeth II, and that was an, an incredible movie. Um, I understand that you went like this every day when you got dressed so that you no, became no. no 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 I I did a thing before I did any shot with Elizabeth we, I, I actually did this I, mean, I did this oh. and that because I always thought of Elizabeth II as being almost like the um, the captain of a submarine she's so way back in herself but looking out through her little periscope of eyes with such clarity at the world around her and with right. sort of such penetration but she's but her personality the reality and, and the vulnerability well, to play a part, the part of a living queen in the country where you live. Oh my goodness! I mean, really that's, dangerous. It's very dangerous. Very dangerous. In a, in a way, <laughs> very dangerous. Do they still behead people in England? Um, <laughs> do they throw people in the tower? But, no, no. But, but you I, did it so beautifully, and uh, and she could not find fault with that. I mean, it was just so fabulously done. Well, I did the the woman that I thought that she was. Right. It was only my portrait of her, yeah. basically. No, of course, but it's yeah. it's just incredible, frightening to play someone who is the queen. Well, and uh, then and then the Elizabeth I. Yes, that was so and those two pictures. Well I look so awful in both of those pictures. Oh no! I mean, do we have a picture <laughs> of Elizabeth? There you oh, are. Oh my God! I, but look at you. Nice dress. I mean, nice dress <laughs> indeed. Nice jewel. <laughs> but um, but what a difficult. Yeah. Oh, that was a, 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 a difficult role. Too, it was but, a great role. Oh, that yes. was one of the greatest roles ever. You and know, uh, that was a, a fantastic. Oh role. well, it was beautifully done. Mm -hmm. The whole production was beautifully done. But. Of, Leaving those two roles aside, because you're playing queens, what other role was, what, what was your favorite role? Do you have a favorite other than? I, I love doing Calendar Girls. You know, that was a fun oh, film yes. to do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was so funny. Now, we had, some of, we had some of those ladies on the show. Oh, did you? Yes, well, we, the real ones. Yes, we the real, the real ones I know, they came fun, and, they Oh, they fantastic. were so nice. And really? they visited us. This is a group of ladies um, who... Uh, made a calendar in the nude. I, I don't know if you remember it at all, but in the nude uh, to raise money for cancer. They were the first ones who did that. Now everybody does it. Yes. You know, farm workers in Ohio do it. Do they have farm workers in Ohio? 
child? Yes, they do. Um, they do. Yes. Well, everybody does it. The firemen of New York have done it. You know, I mean, everybody does it. But they were the first ones, and they they hope to raise something like 400 quid pounds for charity. They have raised to date a million, over a million. Isn't that pounds. wonderful? Yeah. There. Now for the leukemia charity. Another one yes. of my favorite movies is Gosford Park, and I watch that. Yes, I've watched I always mention that because times. people say to me, "Oh, you're always playing queens." I say, "No, I'm not. I'm often below stairs. You know, I was the oh, housekeeper yeah. there. It was fantastic. Yes. But uh, all these roles, you still go into a dressing room, and uh, and can I call you Helen or can oh, I please, call you no, Jane? Call me Helen. Jane. No, don't call okay. me Jane. Uh, no. Helen uh, decorates her own dressing room. I do. And there's yeah. pictures in the book of her dressing rooms decorated, and and, yes. and you, you know, entertain Christmas them. lights. I I do love Christmas lights. <laughs> I mean, I love Christmas lights all year round. I do anything that sparkles. Which, this was the cast of what here? Oh, well, that was uh, the Donmar, the Donmar, <laughs> at Stuart Townsend. That's oh, yeah, Charlie Lord. Theron's uh, boyfriend right in the oh front of the tongue now. <laughs> 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 um, but, you know, I have a lovely antique um, uh, Chinese rug that I always take with me. Quite small, so I can carry it. And then, you know, drapery is always a good thing, isn't it? Bits of fabric I just sort of throw around and fairy lights. And there it is. It's done and dusted. Now, were you, where were you born? I was born in Chiswick in, in England. In England. Yes. And your, yeah. your in father London. came from Russia, though? My father was born in Russia. He was. Yes. Do you speak Russian? I don't, no. I mean, my mother was a, a, a working-class girl from London, so... So from modest beginnings, you are, have become the queen, <laughs> and, well, and so beautifully dressed too. I mean, don't you love? Do you love getting all dolled up in all these fantastic gowns that? that I are do. I have to say the Oscar gown well, because that was, that, beautiful. that was the first time I've had a modern a modern dress, not a costume. I've had a lot of costumes made for me, and I love costumes. There's a side view. Who made but, that for you? Um, uh, Christian Lacroix made oh. it. And, and it was as beautiful on the inside as it was on the outside. You know, the structure of it on the inside oh, yes. was fantastic. Yeah, and you look and, just um, radiant. And I love beautiful. the craft of Why do you have two pairs of shoes thing. here? Well, I've got two, my two feet are two different sizes. Oh. The first time in my life they bought me two pairs of shoes. <laughs> I had one for the first time I've ever had a pair that actually fitted on both feet. Oh. So, well, um, there's so much to see and so much to read <laughs> in this wonderful new book called In the Frame. It's in bookstores now. And guess what? You're all getting a copy in the audience. Yay. That's wonderful. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. When we come back, Helen and I will be in the potting shed. Uh, and Helen has admitted to being a gardener of, on weekends. And we're going to look at a variety of beautiful geraniums. So stay with us. Yeah. Later in the show, Animal Planet's Jeff Corwin will join Martha with some of the exotic animals he's found on his travels around the world.